A major problem of using WhatsApp for businesses is that we do not have efficient chat management and filtration. Using DoubleTick WhatsApp API, we can efficiently manage our own as well as our team's chats by clicking on the left hand side panel and quickly accessing all chats under different status as well as with the ability to apply multiple filters to drill down the chats. So let's understand what are the differences between all chats, my chats, unassigned chats and what are the different statuses under which the chats are bifurcated. So all chats refers to the entire chat of your team members. My chats refers to all the chats that are assigned to you yourself. This view helps you to efficiently reply back to your own set of customers. Whereas in all chats, you get to access and see your team members chats under different different categories. Unassigned chats are the chats where no agent has been assigned. So the chat is lying under unassigned stage. Now let's understand the different subcategories of statuses that we have under each chat window. Once we expand the collapsed version of all chats, we get to see the access to all chats, which means all your team members chats. Under awaiting reply, you get to see the chats where your customer is waiting for your response. As you can see, the last message is by your customer and your agent is supposed to respond to this customer. Under the unread section, you get to see chats which are yet to be read by your team member. Once your team member reads the chat, it is important to click on the mark red button. And once your team member marks the chat as red, it will come under the red chat bucket. The red chat bucket signifies all the chats which have already been read by your team member. The open status signifies chats wherein the meta's conversation window of free form typing is still open. All the chats wherein Meta's free form conversation window is closed comes under the expired category. In expired chats, you can only initiate a conversation from your side by sending a template message. Now, in a separate video, we had covered how to mark a chat as red, block, or by clicking on this tick button how to mark this conversation as resolved. Once your agent clicks on the tick button, the conversation comes under resolved chat. As you can see under the resolved bucket, all the conversation wherein the issue has been resolved are properly segregated. Now these same statuses are available under your chat view as well, as well as under the unassigned chat view. If you want to further drill down the data, you can use the custom filters of assigned to. For example, if you want to see all the chats which are under red category, which are assigned to Amulia and further want to see the customers where the tag is of new customer. This gives you a drill down view of the entire chats. And finally, if you have multiple WhatsApp API numbers linked with your double tick account, you can even filter those chats by the API number on which the chat has been received. I hope by using the filters, you would be able to efficiently look into whether your customers are being responded to on time by your team members. Thanks a lot for watching.